So today we're going to be looking at another one of Gaia Sun's builds. This is the Antares. Okay, so as you can see, it's a Star Trek ship. <laughs> there will it's be notes. Constitution class. No, there, there will be notes. I mean, he he does make a few non-canon builds, so you know, I'll I'll put it's a note a, if it's... that's the case. But Ooh. I think it looks pretty cool, and it's in keeping with the theme. So you know, whatever. I look at uh, ships that aren't start, aren't official all the time, so you know. Yeah, no, that's cool. I like it. It's, it looks awesome. Very sleek. Yeah, yeah. I don't remember there being one like this, but then I haven't seen every Star Trek ship in the world, so you know, who knows? <clears throat> but yeah, this is pretty pretty funky. It's like, <laughs> it's funky. I like it. I don't know if there's going to be much of an interior with it being so thin, but uh. Yeah, let's go, let's check it out. So today I got Kale Surveyor and uh, Ethior with me to help me explore these beautiful ships. So I'm just going to jump out here. We got a gravity block. Nice. Yeah, right inside the door. It's interesting that it didn't sp <coughs> that it spawned on its side. Yeah. Yeah, it's weird. It, it just does it randomly. So okay, so we've got a camera looking out the front. We've got a nice bridge, spacious. It's actually pretty. Pretty legit, yeah, isn't it? On the inside. Yeah. Ooh. And it looks a lot more heavily armed than the Defiant was. I see the core already. Let's have a look down That's here. bad. I think that sometimes they put the core in a place that makes it easy to repair, because when you think about it, right, if you put the core out and it just gets blown up, you die, you get out of it, you get back in it, and it's not dead anymore, and there's minimal amounts of repair. Whereas if you put the core somewhere like, you know, behind all the decoration and behind a load of expensive blocks, it's, do you know what I mean? Wow. You end up having to do more repairs. It's actually quite extensive corridors in here. Yeah, yeah I'm just having a little explore myself. If you've seen the Miranda video we did recently, that's six rather that's extensive. That's crazy, too. yeah, yeah. The Miranda that we did recently was just nuts. I oh, saw that. Look at these. It's beautiful, isn't it, mate? That what you should do is uh, Miranda vs. Constitution. Yeah, yeah, Wait, That's what we're planning to do. <laughs> it's, plan oh. it's in the... Shh, shh. Spoilers? Spoilers? Yes. <laughs> we'll just say that's, that it's still in planning. It's in planning, yeah. We're We've getting got there, all the AI here. Is that, oh, is that oh, a turret? Yeah, yeah, there's a turret point just to... So, yeah. so there's plenty of room for customization if you wanted to, like, you know go all out on the interior and theme it. Plenty of room for extra rooms. Yeah, or whatever you fancy. Like I say, I thought there wouldn't be much room, but looks like because yeah. the dish. Looks are deceiving. <laughs> yeah, and the corridors are legit. They look awesome. Yeah. When you check out like the directions, once we're in the center here, then we can check out the directions. Look at that. It's off in quiet direction either way. So which way should we go? Um, um, Which way is going to be... Is it this way? How do we get home? <laughs> uh, how do we get out of here? Huh. Okay, so that's where you put them. They're like under your feet. Okay, never mind. Uh, that's kind of neat. So is this an airlock? Looks like it, yeah. Yeah, this, and this is ethyl. Step off the side. Yeah, step there off, is... drop out. Where am I going? Oh, I, I don't think we managed down. to find. I didn't find the uh, warp core. I got to go back. <laughs> so yeah, just looking around the outside, we're gonna see these in the cells. Check out the impulse engines. I managed to spawn on the outside of the ship. Oh really? <laughs> well, I got out of my. Oh, I found it. And I was you found it. I found the way in. Like, uh, go to the core. Okay, well, I'm coming up to where my oh, stealth Captain ship is. Oh, Captain Kirk's talking to you. Oh, is he? Okay, hang on. So, oh, whoops, looks like I'm flying then. Okay, so I'm in the core. Uh, let's yeah. check out the statistics on this beast. So, it's got a mass of 11,000, nearly 12,000. It's got a thrust of 19,000, nearly 20. Uh, it's got a length of 308, a height of 36, a width of 43. Oh, I really like this engine room, sorry. Um, yeah, we'll check that out in a minute because I never found that yet. Um, 
and it's got a energy of 1.1 million capacity the recharge is 1.1 million also it has uh, 277,000 shields and uh, 6,500 uh, shields per second. Recovery three. So yeah, let's have a look at the um, engine. How do we get to the engine room from the core, wow. guys? Okay. Uh, I'm chaos, way. stay there. Out. Stay there, Chaos. You. I'll walk from there. I think I can see you. I think He's actually got it. So it looks like the warp core connects to the engines at the sides. Oh no! Hang on, I've gone the wrong way. You can go up like a uh, Jeffrey's tube. <coughs> well, you can go up a Jeffrey's right. tube. But, right, uh, it's like a Jeffrey's going the wrong tube. Way, going. Up the wall. Oh, right, so this is the right way. Nope. Oh, it's tricky. I don't see any tubes. There's a stairway. <laughs> stairs, stairs, where are the stairs? The mystery. There's some Bloody stairs. There's... There you are. All right, follow me. What, where are you? I'm over here. Ah, uh, there you okay, are. Okay, this okay. way. Go up, around, down this way. Yep. There's a door here I already opened. Okay. Now we're in the tail end of the ship. This is the door to engineering, I uh, see. Oh, the curvy corridors are like the signature. Sorry, I have to get some curvy corridor footage. <laughs> and here we are. Alright. Oh, nice. We've got engineering stations. And corridors going to the side. Yep, they go to More both computers. Is that seriously a. It is. Stairwell going up. We're in the nacelles now. Yeah. What? You can go to the nacelles. Huh? No way. Way? <laughs> yes, way. Just I think that's on. why he built it flat, so he could accomplish something like this. Just makes it easier, doesn't it? Yeah. There, there we are. It also means less area to hit you when you're providing oh, up, nice. Look at that. presenting nice. a narrow profile. Yeah, that's, that's true. Yeah. Oh, it's amazing. <laughs> I really like the ship. Yeah, it's great. <laughs> Again, like you said, lots of room to expand or do your own things. Yeah, exactly. Uh. Good job. Good job. It's an awesome ship. Right, so do you reckon we should do these ballistics tests then? Yeah. Uh, if we can find our way out. Yeah, sure. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I know my way around now. Lost oh, in Trek. <laughs> open the core. <laughs> Lost in Trek. I mean, who closes doors in people's faces? I mean, really. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, I'll see you guys outside then. Ah, found another room. Trying to, while well, we were getting out, looks like we got the guns exposed up here. And then down below. Down You've got to check out this uh, rear view. It's quite cool. Rear view? Yeah. Where are you? Out. <clears throat> I'm back in that room you're in. Oh, and go to the back. Yeah. Oh uh, no, see we missed we missed all this stuff. Look at this. Uh -huh. That's that's beautiful. It's got the same kind of thing as the uh, Miranda Bridge does. I mm. like the little planet in the background. <laughs> Where's the way up to the bridge? Uh, let's do the stairway down to the Gotta find uh, the door, man. Uh, the question is how far down. <laughs> <laughs> We'll find it. There's, we'll the find it. There's, there's lots of doors. We'll just oh, need to I'm find back here door. again. No. <laughs> <laughs> we'll we'll go, back, go back past the core and go out that way. That, 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 that we'll go yeah. back. Yeah, yeah, I know. We'll go sideways. Go out one of the sides. There's doors that either end it. Here, here's a way out. There's a ship up here too, if I remember right. Probably. Somebody's cloaky. Hopefully, it's mine. That would be mine. Damn. Well, you could just nick his and take it to yours. True. How many guns? Let's see. One, two, three. Four guns. Give them a go. And one of them is more strong, uh, more powerful than the other three. Okay, well, we only test the. We only test two, so pick two. 
It's only got uh, they're all the, all the all four of these guns are tied to the same weapons computer. Oh right, okay, cool. That's nice and easy then. Right then, so let's get the gel out and uh, take it from the top. Right, so we're going to do the ballistics gel. We've got the uh, ship lined up in front of the cube, so we're going to give it one click. Uh, that was a lovely sound. <laughs> Yeah, it's kind of like a small thunderclap. So we got two. Give it a one second pulse. Going down a couple. Stop. Was that oh, one thousand? That was the second. Huh? That was just a one click. One one thousand. That's better. Right. So it looks like we got about twelve to fifteen. Okay, and now continuous to the other end. Like the other up. one's actually looking a bit stronger. The last one. Two of these guns are rating like 860 and the others are like 660. So basically this is better against shields than hull. I think I killed Splinter. Really? How? I don't know. It just popped up saying he died for some mysterious reason. Died from lack of HP. Looks like he committed suicide. It's taking a while, isn't it? Yep. Let's take a look at the ship up close and see where those projectiles are coming out. It's got turrets on it too, so... Yeah, we can't... well, we. I'm devising a test for turrets at the moment. But it's not ready. So we'll just and have to retest things if we... Uh, if people want it, we'll do it. We'll retest ships if they want it. So. I wow, think you well, can I stop there. It's not really going to get any better than that. Okay, so after a while, it managed to make it to roughly 150. I'd say 140, 150. So we're going to do the one-click test on the defense gel, ballistics test. So it um, simulates rooms and corridors between um, layers of hardened hull. So it goes oh, It went through, through the first. Yeah, it went through the first and... Not through the second. Not through the second. Okay. Very well. I like a Klingon! So we have Chaos Surveyor here today test piloting for us. And we're going to activate the V3 and do round one of this test. Good luck to me. Is that okay. it? Here he comes. Oh, Don't no. be firing your salvage beam. Oh. Shields are getting hammered. But it's actually pierced. It's done some damage to the ship. Oh, yeah, you have. You've done a lot of damage. I'm looking at your shields. They look like they're holding. Oh, no. Shields are going red. Yep. Shields are red. So here we are with the Bobby Fights round one. We're going to put the uh, this ship, this beautiful ship, up against the uh, Migraine Trigger Mark III, which we use for all of our Bobby fights. So, let's make that ship dance. So it's star underscore ship underscore AI space minus one. Yep. Go, go, go. I'm not jammed. I'm now jammed. Okay. Oh, you've done a lot of damage to him. You've yeah, actually cut a nice it. hole. Yeah, you cut a nice hole off of him. Lag. You need to stick and move, son. Stick and move, son. Yeah, stick oh, and no. Oh, no. It's oh, no. Oh, chaos. <laughs> oh, wait. It stopped shooting for a while. Oh, you've got some the holes problems. there, bud. You've got a lot of them. Boom! Did it win? Trigger. Or did you did kill it? it? No, he no, killed he the killed migraine me. trigger. You killed it! So we died at the same time. <laughs> what? Wait, you... no. No, the trigger's, the still trigger's okay. <laughs> the trigger's still alive. The trigger's still okay. Can you teleport me, please, buddy? So, the trigger took some damage. Let's it did a lot better than the Defiant. Did. Yeah. All the turrets have popped off. Um, 
<laughs> Have a look now. Yeah, we got a clean hole right the way through. Nice. <clears throat> it didn't take long to break its shields. But that survived much better than the last one. Mm hmm. That was a good fight. I enjoyed that one. That was cool. And the migraine trigger. Mm. Migraine trigger's fine. No surprise there, really. No, it's, it's got a, a hole. It's a pickle. <laughs> It's yeah. got a couple of holes through it, but it's still intact. That's the thing. It's the only way you've got to get a hole right down the middle, all the way down the middle, or the waffle shoot is the uh, tail. The waffle is pretty uh -oh. banged up. Uh oh, who's uncloaked? Oh no! It's on oh, the no. move. It's on the move. Oh, you no. didn't do it again. Kill it! Kill it. It's dead. That's Oof. funny. You keep Object spawning. Object not found. Yeah, I killed it. You keep spawning. We keep spawning the. Uh, Keep spawning the thing back <laughs> and killing our test pilots. <laughs> test monkeys. Okay, so that was an awesome ship, and we've got more of them coming up right now. So stay with us, and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>